All right, beautiful day in San Diego, mid-80s temperature. This is game two between Houston Astros and Tampa Bay Rays. And if you're a baseball fan, this is a great game. A lot of crazy things happen. Lance McCullers Jr. is on the hill for the Houston Astros. And Charlie Morton throwing the pill for the Tampa Bay Rays. And pretty much from the get-go, Morton was dealing. Here's some cheese to Altuve. Sit down, 95 mile per hour. And then bottom of first, rare thing happened. Top fielding team in baseball made two errors, and Altuve made two of them. There's one of them. And you know what happens when you make errors in the playoffs. It leads to moments like this. Three, two, bomb. Manuel Margot making his presence felt with a 406-foot blast, 25-degree launch angle. And he had a day. This isn't the only highlight that he had on the field. Here's his second highlight. Top of two. Springer hits a 268-foot fly ball. And Margot goes up and over the wall, makes the catch, ends the inning. Next to the Bellinger catch that robbed Tatis for a home run, I got to give this second in the playoffs for best catch. Umpire's like, he's out. Let's take a look at it again. He ended up being okay and staying in the game. Up and over. And here's the pitcher of the day. And now you're going to see an umpire run faster than you've ever seen before. Look at him go. And Springer, there's his reaction. And... Morton was just cruising along. He got a little help from his defense here on a play against Altuve. Joey Wendell makes a fantastic play at third. Now, granted, in Houston's defense, they were rallying the first four innings. They could have easily scored runs. This could have been easily a different ball game, but Morton was just making the right pitches at the right time. Now, bottom of the seventh, the announcer just said McCullers retired 14 in a row, which means, boom, that means the next guy up is going to crush a home run. Mike Zunino. Absolutely murdered this pitch. 454 foot shot, 32 degree launch angle. That was pretty much the name of the game. Now, McCullers pitched a fabulous game. If it wasn't for the errors by his team, he pitched fabulous. So, credit to Houston in their pitching. They held uh, Tampa to four hits. But then, you know, Tampa with their pitching staff, Morton pitched fabulous. And they closed it out, even though uh, Houston started rallying at the end. But game two goes to Tampa.